Surprise, surprise, motherfucker! The king is back! Here he is, the number one UFC welterweight contender. He has never fought for the title before, but on the strength of a long winning streak, he has arrived at the precipice of a world championship. He's been working so long to put himself in this position. He has been working so diligently to try to earn himself a shot at a championship. Tonight, he gets that opportunity. He is a well-rounded fighter. He's so tremendous in all aspects of mixed martial arts. I cannot wait to see him compete and try to become the champion. And I'm not sure that any athlete in this welterweight division has handled adversity, professional and otherwise, as well as this man has. He is forged as he hits the proven ground for his first UFC title fight. This is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here today. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. And that means we are set for our main event of the evening. All right, now let's get you our tail of the tape for this welterweight championship fight. We sent it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, the warrior. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC welterweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. And there's Herb Dean. He ready. will handle the action inside ready. the octagon. Good. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles. And it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Good night if that landed. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. It's always funny watching the beginning of these fights as guys try to really set the tone of the fight, the pace at which we are going to fight. Nicely timed to the body for the champion. No defense. These two are going back and forth. Nice body kick there.
right, so an opportunity goes by the boards. He had him stunned, nearly finished, and now his opponent has recovered. His opponent recovered. Now he's got to deal with everything that he's going to bring at him. He should have got the fight finished at that time. Right hook to the head blocked. Back and forth we go. These two guys are trading huge shots. That was lightning fast, that right in. Oh, and the Superman punch is good. Now some separation from his clutch position. Nice body kick. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not head-hunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now, and it's starting to show itself. Beautiful kick to the body. Shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, my goodness. Big right hand. Oh, and stop. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. You ready to fight? Ready. Cool. All right, round two. Oh, that one landed, yep. Misses again with a right punch. All right, so as advertised thus far, as these fighters continue to trade strikes. Beautiful setup to the leg kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice leg kick. Oh, great block there. Big right hook there by the champ. Again, going back to the jab, just out of range. Just over three minutes to go. Great commitment to the kicking game. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Get that high kick up there. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Well, he's really picked up the pace here. And... Oh, got to keep pressing here. Big shot to the head. He looks like Pac-Man. He's taking so many strikes to the head. Hands up. Circling towards the left now. Oh, strong hook to the head there by Lee. Devastating uppercut. Nice. Nice job blocking that punch. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. 45 seconds remain in the round. You need to work. 
man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. 20 seconds left. Able to connect with a beautiful jab. So we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Here we go. Third round of this championship. Strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. There's that left hand. And now some separation. appearing on that left side now. Got him. Oh, yeah. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Another nice kick there. Solid series of kicks. They're all landing now. Straight punch is good. Gentlemen are absolutely going at it. Let's see who'll have the upper hand. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. A flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. That's a big strike right there. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. Just out of range with that strike. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Lee gets hit with a kick. Doing a really good job of throwing those leg kicks. Oh, knee strike right to the body. Just missed on that spinning attack. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Fifteen seconds to go. Oh, that's a brutal cut on his nose there. He is bleeding. All right, three rounds down, potentially two more to go. We are headed to the championship rounds. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. All right, 60 seconds between rounds. That gives us a chance to look at some of the replays from that previous round, including some of the damage sustained on his nose. Yeah, it was a, it was a nice shot that landed that opened up that cut on the nose. Granted, any cut is bad, but this one is in a spot where it shouldn't affect him too much. What fight? we have to watch, though, John, Ready. is if the nose is broken. Right. Then it's hard for him to breathe. Yeah, get the blood in that nasal cap. <laughs> Like that to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. 
All right, here we go. The tension is palpable. Fourth round is underway. You've got a thing or two to say about this championship round. The fourth round is easily the hardest round in the oh! So the other oh! trying to guard pass here, not today. No, it ain't happening. Good job understanding the transition. Side control now. Big ground and pump. Well, we may have the best cut men and women in the business, but I'm not sure they're going to be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing stroke. And you're fighting a great fighter. It's hard to deal with the damage of the cut while dealing with the level of the fighter in front of you. Right now, you've got to do something different to try and change the way that this fight is playing out. Well, at this point, DC, I'm not sure if he's just biding his time or just trying to get some extra reps, but go finish them. It seems like the guy's playing with his food. You know, he's having a good time out there. Everything's working. He's in the zone. It feels like at any moment he can end the night of his opponent. But he seems to be having fun. And hey, to each his own, I guess. I'd be rushing out of that octagon. Yeah, you don't play with your food. No. Well, he's had next to no answers for the body shot. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to pace down that finish. Big shots being landed on both sides. Slip to avoid that right hand. That'll do it! Oh my goodness! With a massive highlight at the garden. Holy! With that, we now go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 53 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USC welterweight champion of the world, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and giving this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about. You know he's going to get everyone's best shot, but more often than not, Lee's skill 